Hi friends, Laura over at Hello Cute Crafts here. And today I wanted to share how I transfer this ordinary, boring water bottle into something fun and inspirational for me to work out with. And I'll be using my Cricut Joy today. So let's get started. I have already washed with soap and water the inside and outside of this bottle. But before I apply vinyl to it, I'm gonna go ahead and clean it off with an alcohol swipe. Go ahead and make sure that the base is nice and clean. You'll let it dry completely. So I'm gonna go ahead and set this aside for now. And let's get, it's, let's get started with the software. So you could easily do this on the computer, which is where I normally do it. But for this workspace, I went ahead and I'm gonna show you how to use the iPad with the Cricut Joy. Um, I'm using Design Space on the iPad, but Cricut Joy also has its own app which I can show you at a different time. So I'm gonna do a new project and I'm gonna keep this one. I had already looked it up, but it was a uh, fitness inspirational quote. I'm gonna make sure that the width is the size that I need for this bottle. So I'm gonna change the width to two inches and that will make the height at four, which should work for this bottle. And then I'm gonna hit make it. And for this case, I have a mat all ready to go with my white vinyl. This will be on a mat. And this is what it'll look like before it starts printing. I am gonna do a basic cut on this mat with no mirror. So we'll hit next. And I need to turn on my Cricut, so hold on. Okay, so it's going to ask for the material, and I'm going to look for vinyl. And this is just regular vinyl, actually premium vinyl. And then you just follow the steps. The Cricut Joy is that easy. You literally just follow the steps on the computer or machine. So I'm going to load my vinyl in. see it just says press go so we'll press the little go button Okay, and now it says to unload the material, so you can go ahead and do that. So the next part is my favorite part, is the weaving. So we're going to keep the portion that will be on the water bottle. It'll remain on the trans, on this vinyl sheet. And then we're going to transfer it with using transfer paper. And you just take all out all the negative these items so that you have your vinyl to go on the water bottle.
Next, what we're going to do is take what you have cut out and attach the transfer tape to it. I'm going to trim this a little so we don't use as much transfer tape and it makes it easier to go on the water bottle. This is transfer tape. And this is gonna go on top. I just cut as so. And so you're going to take your transfer tape and put it on top of your vinyl. Oopsie. A little bit of static to it. You're gonna go like that and you're gonna use a credit card or your little Cricut tool and you are going to press as firmly as you can to both sides. And this is what helps to get the vinyl onto the transfer. have done it correctly it should just come right off and sometimes it takes a little longer to do so depending on the complexity of the vinyl this one looks pretty good and the last step will be to apply your vinyl to the water bottle and let's see if I can do this while videotaping kind of want it in the middle Because it's a rounded space, I usually start in the center and then I'll press down on both sides. Meaning that it's a rounded material, you can't really use the credit card or the tool. So I just firmly press with my finger. If you're really having a hard time or you have difficult vinyl, sometimes old vinyl can be harder to attach. You can also use a blow dryer or a heating tool element just a little bit to give it a little bit of warmth and that kind of helps. And then what you'll do is you'll take it off the transfer tape. Ready for the magic? Ta-da! Cute, right? Now I'm ready to go work out. Well, I hope you enjoyed this tutorial. If you have any suggestions on another project, please feel free to let me know in the comments or message me. And thanks again, and I hope you subscribe.